Welcome to the latest edition of our CIO Insights. It is really nice to be out here at the Lake of Zurich. Summer has finally arrived. This year, we had to wait for a long time and during cold and wet weather in spring before we could jump into the lake and swim. For kids, the long wait felt like eternity. It seems also in financial markets, many participants are enduring a long phase of waiting. Maybe some of you are familiar with Samuel Beckett's play Waiting for Godot, in which two characters, Vladimir and Estragon, are waiting for Godot, who never arrives. It seems to me that most economists, strategists and also many investors have been doing the same over the last 12 months. They were waiting for the US recession, which never arrives. Looking at the global picture, it appears that the macro momentum, which rebounded in Q4 2022, driven mainly by Europe and to a lesser extent China, is rolling over as we speak. This means that gross surprises are likely to be negative in the second half of this year. The impact of more restrictive monetary policies will dampen economic activity and lead to negative revisions in corporate earnings. This is the main reason why we are sticking to a defensive positioning in our multi-asset portfolios. Overall, investors should not be too bearish as the waiting for Godot period might continue to last longer than we think. Nevertheless, our base case is that the US recession will finally arrive towards the end of the year. In such an environment, bonds look more attractive than equities from a risk-adjusted point of view. High-quality bonds should generally do well in an environment of high uncertainty and falling nominal growth. In order to protect our portfolios against the risk of longer-term inflation, we also continue to like inflation-linked bonds and gold. The demand for gold is rising as central banks globally have added to their positions. The core allocation of every portfolio should always be in high-quality equities with a sustainable growth profile. With an allocation to themes like technological disruption, which includes the sub-theme of artificial intelligence, or the green transition, which benefits many companies and creates a lot of opportunities, a portfolio is well-placed to benefit from longer-term growth stories. After all, our ambition is to generate long-term sustainable performance. No matter what the market conditions are, no matter whether it is raining or the sun is shining. I hope this summer we will have a lot of sunny days and I wish you all a good time and successful investing. Thanks a lot for your interest.